Alrighty, so my name is Gixmergen, and this video will be looking at how to find your own swarms. So, what is a swarm? A swarm is a group of four Pokemon that appear in the overworld, like this masquerade up here. Swarms can be interacted with. They'll make a little noise. You'll enter an encounter with the species of the Pokemon that was in the overworld. So we saw a Masquerain in the overworld, and now we are encountering a Masquerain, uh, you know, in a battle. <laughs> so a lot of people think that swarms have better stats. However, I do not believe that such a claim has been backed up. And you will find that if you keep all your swarm Pokemon and keep track of all their IVs, that they generally just have normal old IVs. Nothing too crazy about them. Uh, some people think they have an increased shiny chance, uh, but that is not the case. They are 1 in 30,000, just like every other Pokemon encounter. And... I think that about covers the misconceptions. Wow, that one hit my Breloom. So here are the stats of the Masquerain that I just caught. As you can see, there's nothing too crazy here. It's just... Kind of average. Yep. So I did say there's four of them, so there's another one up there. And as you can see, there's another one down there, and another one down there. So there's two down there, and one up on the waterfall. Very nice. But anyway, on to how to find a swarm. The first thing you can do is you can hang out in Global. Global chat will frequently have people that say where the swarms are. Uh... If you want to not have to look at it all the time, because it can be a little frustrating, um, you can have chat notifications, which you can access through this speaker icon on the chat window. When you click this, this window will appear. You have a couple of options here. It says highlight sound, so it'll be a little beep, and whisper highlight sound, and that's a different beep, but it's specific to the uh, when you get a whisper. And so what you can do with this box here is uh, generally it will be empty and you'll want to type swarm and hit enter and there you go. That will then ping you with a little beep every single time swarm is said inside of the chat here. Now you may have seen that I have other words here. Uh, the thing appears to be case sensitive meaning I have a lowercase swarm, a swarm with an uppercase first letter, and swarm in all caps. So if somebody's getting a little excited about the swarm, you know, you're still going to be alerted. And down here I have pheno, phenomenon, and phenomenon. Uh, these, this is a common way of typing it, I guess. Most people just say pheno. Uh, however, pheno are another thing separate from swarms, but it is something that people do report in global, and you might want to have these in your notifications, uh, assuming that you have Unova unlocked, as Fino are exclusive to Unova. Oh, for the notifications, be sure to hit save when you're done changing things. Uh, but yeah, swarms and Unova do not have anything from televisions, so... I will show television locations for the other regions in a moment, but if you interact with a television in Unova, nothing happens as it is not implemented yet, so I'm interacting with this TV right now and just nothing is appearing. So yeah. You cannot check swarms in Unova through the TV. You have to either see it or have someone else see it and report it. But. The other regions, Kanto, Hoenn, and Sinnoh, all have televisions with that sort of capability, so we'll go over those locations right now. Right here, you can either surf from this spot, or walk around so you don't encounter a Pokemon. I like to surf, this is pretty quick. You just go into this house right here, and interact with this TV. And it will say something random if there's nothing being reported. There's a bunch of funny jokes in there, you can probably have a look there for a few minutes and see some interesting various random things. Uh, but yeah, so 
these TV locations are all going to be conveniently placed near the swapping point for between regions. Look, someone's here checking now. And there you go. There's no route mentioned here, uh, but they have a specific format that they follow where they will mention a character's name, reports that they've seen the Pokemon, and it will tell you the location afterward. And so let's have a look over here. All right, so here we go. This is what the format looks like when there is actually a swarm being reported by the television. It'll say, breaking news, we've just heard word from Barry. In this case, it'll, it's Barry, but it'll be any trainer that's local to the region that is, you know, playing a role in the story. Yeah, so breaking news, we've just heard word from local trainer that wild Paris have been spotted near the Great Marsh. So this tells you what Pokemon and at what location. So let's go check out the Great Marsh. Great Marsh has just appeared. It's the Safari Zone of Sinnoh. Let's see. Let's just ride the train, see if we can find it. There it is. There's some Paris. They're swarming. So I have to go back. Alright, so there we go. Paris Swarm. Fantastic. Well, alrighty. Thank you for watching. Good luck finding swarms.